In this video, I'm going to show you how to calculate tack time. To learn how to calculate lead time, we've got a separate video. Also, we have a longer video about the differences between cycle time, tack time, and lead time. The links for both of those are in the comments below. So how to calculate tack time with a worked example. You can see here that we've got a definition of tack time and a calculation below. So it's how frequently we need to produce a part or product to satisfy our customer. And that's calculated by dividing your daily operating time, your net available time, by your daily production quantity required, the daily demand from the customer. You can see that the daily operating time, you net off things like breaks, clean brief time, 5S, wash up time. Onto the next slide, you see that we've got the information, all the information you need to calculate tech time for a, our example factory. It works one shift a day, seven till three, two 15 minute breaks, 20 minute lunch, five minutes wash up at the end, five minutes 5S time at the end. It works five days a week, and in one week, the customer needs 350 parts. So let's go back to our calculation. You see we circled daily operating time here, and that's the bit we'll calculate. So the first four points on our information for the factory are what we need here. You can see that eight hours per shift times 60 minutes is 480 minutes. Take off our breaks, that's 50 minutes off, then another 10 minutes off for the wash up and 5S gives us a net time, net daily operating time of 420 minutes. Let's plug that into our calculation on the top there, the numerator, 420 minutes, and now we'll do the bottom bit, which is the daily production quantity required. For this, we need the last two bullet points, knowing that it works five days a week and we've got a weekly demand of 350 parts. 350 parts divided by five is 70. So the bottom part of the equation is 70. 420 divided by 70 is six minutes tack time. So your tack time is six minutes here. Now we'll go to a stripped down value stream map. You can see that in the top right there, tack time is six minutes. Every cycle time in the process must be below that. And in this case, you can see the process B and assembly will have a problem. 